Now that dancers can discriminate between the toe dig and the heel drop, they are ready to combine those two ideas for a traveling exercise. Critical to success will be the idea of lifting to a released and a relaxed ankle and knee. It helps to be able to use a word to describe the energy. I like to use the word press. So I'm going to say lift, press, heel, heel. And on that last one, completely shift my weight so I can lift, press, heel, heel. Eventually, you'll just cut that down to just one heel, and the rhythm will be lift, press, heel, release to the next foot. And then eventually, our goal is going to be, in quarter no time, press, heel, press, heel, as in press, heel, press, heel. They'll be able to move side to side and forward and back and in circles. And most importantly, of course, is that strong press downward, not forward. So remember to lift and just let the foot come down. Even if they don't travel very far at the beginning, the importance is where the energy is going and the fact that all three screws are connecting with the floor, which allows for strong sound followed by a strong heel drop.